And Ricky, why did you end up popping your balloon? First and foremost, I couldn't get past the shoes. Like they squeezing your feet and it's like they're suffocating. Uh, I just couldn't get past that. Okay. For me, another thing, the physical attraction just mm -hmm. wasn't there for me. Mm -hmm. Like wasn't my speed. Like when I look at something, I want to be like, oh, I got to get that. Or, right. I, I need that. And it's just right. like, oh, huh. next. What's up, guys? It's your boy once again. And we're back with another Pop the Balloon whatever you want to call it. These things becoming so popular and crazy, man, they're everywhere. But the fact that people will go up here and take a chance on getting drugged, I mean drugged, it just amazes me. And the fact, some people think they are fine when they really not. And I think this is what's happened to this young lady. Like she had it at one time maybe, but you don't have it anymore. Y'all check this out. And don't forget, hit that subscribe, like, and share. And let's get it. Mm, mm, mm. <laughs> okay, let's go ahead and bring out our next single lady. Hello, welcome in. I'll have you take that. What's your name? Uh, Brianna. Brianna? Mm -hmm. How old are you? I'm 29. And what? A bullshit? A bullshit? A bullshit. Bullshit. And what do you do? Um, I'm an entrepreneur. Okay. Do you have any businesses we could be on the lookout for? Uh, no, just not right now. Okay, okay. Mm -hmm. <laughs> now hold up, hold up. Let, let's, let's take a deep dive into this. Because she's saying she's 29. And something ain't right. Let's check her out. Okay, so this chick says she's 29. Ah... Uh, I don't know, man. I don't know. Let's let's look at her. Let's look at her IG like this. Look at this thing. All right. So, what is showing? She eight hundred forty four followers, thirty eight posts, one hundred fourteen following. Mama three. Okay. Uh, what's that? Cash talk, TikTok, cash talk, all that. Uh, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know, man. We gotta. Something don't look right about this. She's saying she's 29, but she looked like she's like 10 years older. So let's look at some of the IG pics. Now, this one particular over here in the corner with the red hair, look how thin she was. Now, you're only 29. So I'm thinking, what, unless that was in your teens and why you posting in your underwear in your teens on social media, it's crazy. But you're now a couple years later, and you are significantly bigger. That's what I don't understand. And you must have had your kids back to back. Okay, so, and then we get to the, you know, the posing, you know. And you, here you go. You got the, you got the simps. You know, they jumping in, giving you all this sweet nothing. So what's, what's this, um... Oh, they was rough on you. Oh, they did you so wrong. Oh, look at the little simp dude. And that, see, and that's the thing. That will have these type of women boosted up like this. All it take is one simple simp and comes on there and brightens up her day. All right. But you get these other guys <laughs> that come on there and tell her don't hide that stomach. <laughs> Let it hang. You know what I mean? So... You know, you go catch it both ways. Like, you trying to lean over and show because you done gained all this weight now. And it could have been from having the kids. You could have had them back to back. But she definitely looks older than 29. I'm not going to front on that. Um, I don't know what the issue is with that. But, but you come on the show and act as if, like, like you still that slim chick. Now, she was nice looking when she was younger. I ain't going to say younger, but thinner. But now you look like an older lady, you're like you're in your 40s, to be honest. And I'll give you a late 30s, late 35, going into 40, but you definitely like 29. 39, maybe so, but not, not 29, not 29. All right, so let's get back to it. There's some things you like to do for fun. Um, I'm a gamer, so I just more be to myself. Okay. Um, I'm a PC gamer, so I got like 
I'm a gamer. That's all. Okay. <laughs> That's what I love to do for fun, to be honest. So. <laughs> all right. Um, and now, what are some things you look for in a man? Um, a confident man, loyal. Um, I don't know. A man that really knows about himself, you know. Um, not really on career set, you know, just more of if he knows what he want to go for. Mm. Um, so, you know, just a confident man that knows how to treat a lady. Okay. Mm. Now, what are some deal breakers? Uh, a felon. Um, um, I don't know, a judgmental man. I don't like nobody that just judge, you know, off of appearance or anything like that. Mm -hmm. So, okay. that's really it. Cool. Mm -hmm. All right, so we did get a few pop balloons. Mm -hmm. Let's go on over there, see why they ended up popping. Okay. All right, let's start here with your name and age. How you doing? Uh, my name is Ishama. I'm 37. Okay. And Ishama, why did you end up popping your balloon? I apologize. It was the tattoos that caught oh, me, yeah. and I'm just not a fan of too much oh, tattoos and stuff like that. I, even though I have tattoos myself, mm -hmm. it's just like, yeah, it was just a little too yeah. much, but gorgeous yourself, though. Thank you. No problem. Mm -hmm. Now, is, is Ishama someone that's your type? You're not bad looking. Appreciate that. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Okay. What, what type of answer was that? You're not bad looking. And he was real nice about his, you know, answering his question. They didn't want to offend the lady. But you're sitting here looking. I mean, you're extremely big. Let's just be honest. And your clothes are not fitting. And you looking at him a certain way, like, and then the tattoos. And ladies, this is what we always tell you when you're young and thin and young and all this stuff. Yeah, the tattoos look good. They look real good. But when you start getting old and gaining weight, now she just started gaining weight early because at 29, she shouldn't be looking like that. But the tattoos don't look so good now. They really and truly don't. You got neck tattoos in your arm and back. I have tats, but... It's a way you look at your woman with tats. It's totally different. Totally different. And so, I don't know, man. I don't know. Not a good look, lady. <laughs> Let's go to our next guy. Your name and age. Ricky, and I'm 32. Nice to meet you. And Ricky, why did you end up popping your balloon? First and foremost, I couldn't get past the shoes. Like, they squeezing your feet, and it's like they're suffocating. Uh, I just couldn't get past that. Okay. For me, another thing, the physical attraction just mm -hmm. wasn't there for me. Mm -hmm. Like, wasn't my speed. Like, when I look at something, I want to be like, oh, I got to get that. Or, right. I, I need that. And it's just right. like, oh, huh, next. Mm -hmm. So, like, the attraction wasn't there. Okay. All right. Mm -hmm. So, is Ricky someone that's your type? I mean, he's cool. Okay. Cool? You got a strong face. Oh. I love it, though. You mean like his jawline? Is that what yeah. you mean strong? Oh, mm -hmm. okay, okay. Oh. You should eat a lot more, but I love it. Thank you. Appreciate that. Mm -hmm. <laughs> now, now, wouldn't this been messed up if he would have said, uh, you need to eat less? You know what I'm saying? That's why our let's start laughing. You sitting here, 29, probably 275 or 280. I give you 255, 270, 255 to 270. At 29 years old, telling somebody they need to eat more. But he played it cool. Bro just, you know, he trashed about the shoes because you got these old lady sandals on and you squeezed into this entire outfit. But to tell somebody they need to eat more when you need to eat less? Come on, man. This delusional, man. This shit's so... You are beautiful as well. Thank so you. I never thought I wasn't. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Let's go on over here to our next guy. Your name and age. Trey and I'm 29. Hello. Trey, why did you end up popping your balloon? Uh, kind of like what my boy said down there, just a the neck tattoo. I don't really <laughs> like it. So everything else is perfect, though. Okay. okay. Mm -hmm. the tattoos. Yeah. <laughs> I love them. They're my favorite part about me. Yeah. yeah. Unbreakable. <laughs> oh, is that what that says? <laughs> yes, it does. Oh, yeah. okay. You're cool, though. <laughs> yeah. Okay. So he's cool. Yeah. Cool. You know what I think it is? I think when she was a little younger, but maybe before she had the last kid or whatever, she still had a nice looking body. She's not a no, she wasn't an ugly woman or anything. I mean, she's not ugly now. She just got that older look to her now. But I think these ladies think they still got it. So she's still trying to move like she told the other guy, you know, he said, You're a beautiful woman. And she made that little smart comment. He was like, Oh, no, you don't still have it, lady. You don't. I'm sorry, you don't. Now, some guy's gonna be nice to you and tell you this or that, but you don't look like you're 29, so I think you might be lying on that. But if not, if not, you need to go get in the gym. I'm just being honest, get your nutritionist, get in the gym, nothing wrong with it. I tell everybody to do the same. 
you need to go get in the gym. Because thinking you still that young, slim, slim, thick, nah. You're thick, thick. I'm sorry. You're thick, thick right now. Next. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go over here. Hello. Your name and age. Timothy, I'm 37. Okay. Hi. And Timothy, why did you end up popping your balloon? Um, just not attracted. I don't like the tattoos and the <laughs> leg. You got a leg tattoo. Um, Aw. I just don't see myself having fun with you. Like, okay. I wanna, I'm looking to have some fun. Right. And I uh, just... I don't know. It's okay. And little, the weight, you're, you're kind of overweight for me, too. Okay. Mm-hmm. Okay. All right. So is Timothy someone that's your type? No, he looks his age. Oh. He does look like he's 37. It's okay, though. Okay. He's about 9, 10 years older than me. But I do. You, it's cool. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Yeah. I'm going to tell you what confuses me with a lot of people. He said he was 37. So you try to insult him by saying, yeah, he looked like he's 37. I said I was 37. So, I mean, if I look like it, I'm okay. But you're 29 and look like you're 39. Now, he could have made easy work out of this real quick. He just laughed and just looked. Yeah, you look his age. He look his age. Chick, you don't look 29. But like I said, these guys ain't trying to be sit out here and get, you know, labeled as bashing or disrespecting another black woman and all this stuff. But you black women do not hesitate or care about disrespecting a black man anywhere, anytime. You do not. And brothers need to stop trying to be so easy on the ones that come for them. You ain't got to get out of character, but stop being so easy. A simple little like, oh, well, you definitely don't look 29. Would have shut her up. <laughs> Next. Let's head back. <laughs> so we do have one unpopped balloon. Right. Um, any questions for each other? Yeah, how many kids you got? I got three. <laughs> okay. Kids obviously are a deal breaker, but before that, is she someone that's your type? Yeah, she look good. You know, I like the tattoos, you know, that's like, they look nice. But Thank you. Just the key is my limit. I ain't going to lie. You. Can't, can't even lie to you. That's good. Okay. Mm -hmm. Now, is Cedric someone that's your type? No. Okay. What makes him not your type? The way he looks. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not trying to be funny. He's just not my type. Not for oh. real. So when you say the way he looks, like his the face. outfit. Oh, okay. He's fine. Okay. All right, cool. Thank you. Okay. Don't back. laugh. Please. You're making me laugh. I'm not trying not him. to. <laughs> he should be the last person laughing on this stage. Oh. Yeah. Who? The last guy? Yeah. Why are you laughing at him? Oh, okay. Sorry. Okay. <laughs> See what I'm saying? See? Dude didn't say nothing bad about her, but what she do? Went straight for it. His look, his face. And then you get mad at the guy at the end to my, don't be funny. You the last one need to be laughing. They're not laughing at him. They are laughing at you because they are looking at your body and saying you got the nerve to talk about somebody. You come in here with this too little dress on and these old, old sandals that your feet are squeezed up in. But see, she didn't say nothing about them first couple guys when they got her. She waited to the guy, that the timid guy. You could tell this guy, he's a little timid. He, nobody picked him, you know, throughout the whole thing. They always popped this balloon. But you're going to go off because he popped you because of those kids. And see, nobody else questioned you about kids or anything. They never got a chance. But the only guy that was holding on a balloon popped. But I'm popping because you got three kids. But you're going to say he's basically ugly. But nobody clown you about your weight. But one dude, he said, just too much weight. Yeah, you ain't like that. But like I said before, you sisters have no problem disrespecting a black man. Each one of these men tried to be real polite to her. But she had no problem trying to disrespect a few of them. And that's why I keep telling you guys, stop being a, a, just stop being a sucker, man. You're not here to be run over just because they're black women. But we always get it from our own. Now, people tell me, oh, you on your show, your platform be bashing women. I don't bash no woman. 
I just talk about what they talk about. This video is already out there. I'm just reacting to it. But it's her behavior and what she said that's causing me to say what I say. I'm just reacting to what she says. She came on here. There's a, a million people on that video, and you came out here looking like that. But you thought you still had it, and you don't. Simple as that. All right. Well, that is all the balloons thank pops. You. Bobby, do thank you so much for coming thank on. You. Let's go ahead and give it up for her, guys. I'll take this mic. Thank, thank you. you. There you have it. Another tragic, tragic end. Well, she walked out. Everybody popped except one, so she knew what time it was. But that's the thing when you step up there and you think you put on your your best and you come up there and everybody pops as soon as they see you. That got to mess with you mentally, you know. But I will try to ease through this thing, get up out of there, like find out, so what is it? Like, okay, all right, I'm going to go work on that. You know that? I'm going to work on it, and hopefully this thing right, I'm going to come back. But to get upset and try to clown a guy here and there about their looks, when your looks got you popped as soon as you walked out. But see, a lot of ladies can't take that rejection. See, men used to it. You know, we get rejected for walking in a room and not even wanting anybody. Everybody to look, mm, frowns. <laughs> so we know. But you? Nah, you ladies? Nah, y'all can't handle that. Uh, I mean, at all. She did terrible handling it. You know you're not the same anymore. You probably was 129 pounds in those pics in your IG, and now you 100-something pounds more. Come on, lady. And you're only 29. You shouldn't be looking like that. Go get in the gym. I, 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 get, I, I can guarantee the babies added the weight on. And I don't trash no woman for gaining weight for having a child. You have trying to have your child healthy child. I understand that. But after you have this child, you need to start working on getting yourself back right. Simple as that. You got to change the nutrition. You got to get in the gym, get you a trainer. Whatever you can do, do it. But one thing I noticed about this lady, she didn't have a job. She said she was an entrepreneur, and when they asked her what to look out for, what you got going on, she said nothing yet. So how are you an entrepreneur and you don't have anything going on and you don't have a job? You're sitting at home collecting a check. Let's be real. You see what I'm saying? So when you put it all together, you're sitting at home with three kids. You're not working. You're talking about you're an entrepreneur when you're just a gamer online. Instead of being a gamer, you might want to go get a job. But you come out here, get mad at these guys, and try to clown them, and you're 29 looking 39. So much wrong with this whole picture, man. So much. But, guys, y'all let me know what y'all think is my analysis about right, wrong. I'm not bashing, ladies. I'm not bashing. Calm down. I'm just explaining. And it's your boy, and I'm up out of here. Y'all stay cool. I'm out. Peace. <laughs>